When I was a little boy, I wanted to be a hero. The truth is, when you get older, sometimes things don't always turn out the way you hoped they would. So you gotta do what you gotta do. Handle that business. Believe in yourself. Create your own destiny. Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. I just honestly want to say thank you to everybody that's been showing so much support to me in this uh, new journey of mine um, into playing rugby. Um, I never thought, honestly, that I would be playing, you know, just me coming from, you know, Dallas, Texas, football guy. You know, my goal was always, you know, NFL, and I never was thinking outside of the box. And this opportunity that came to me um, is once again, it's, it's, it's an emotional experience. Um, I played my first game in two days. We leave tomorrow to New Orleans. We play NOLA. Um, the game will not be televised or anything. I think it's just like an ex expedition match or something. So um, hopefully I can get some game film uh, for myself. Maybe I can just kind of like analyze uh, myself um, for the video. Uh, but I don't think I'll have like full on game film. So that being said, I'll try my best to get what I can for you guys uh, to um, to show you pretty much my gameplay. Uh, so I've, I've been training basically for two weeks and a little bit over two weeks now. Uh, training's been good. Still trying to learn. Um, I've actually been hopped around a few positions. Um, well, not really a few, just like center, center and wing uh, pretty much. Uh, but for this game, I will be playing wing um, coach. Pretty much said, just run the ball. <laughs> uh, but pass, I, I feel confident. I'm confident, honestly. I'm actually confident in my passing. Um, I'm confident in my passing. It's actually the fact that when I get the ball, it's more so of what do I do? You know, it's like, yeah, I know I'm supposed to run, but it's like, you know, I'm looking for a run or an attack and maybe a pass off somebody else. Or should I just run, try to bulldoze through um, or do what I can to score the try? And um, if I don't get if I get tackled, uh, get down, try to get the team back the ball. Um, so it's just a lot of things going in my mind. And it's like um, I'm slightly scared. Well, I won't say scared. I'll say nervous um, because it's been a very long time, um, a very, very, very long time since I've been in a competitive sport. And, um, you know, to be at a, a professional level, you know, finally, it's um, very, it's just, just very nerve wracking, especially for a new, a totally new sport. It's not like professional level when I play a sport where I know about, um, it's, it's a totally new sport. So it's just like, just the rules itself is very overwhelming um, on the things that you can do in rugby and I'm just trying to grasp as much as possible um, so that you know I, I can become better so I can help out my team um, I don't I don't want to just be a person that just gets the ball and run I want to know the game so I can help my team in situations so I, I can understand what you understand the game better you're able to do things outside of the box um, than just your position and that's the, the goal I have for myself um, you know I, I definitely do need to study more I've been watching hella games hella film hella highlights hella players I've been watching hella people but I need to narrow it down to actually opening up my book more and uh, writing down stuff for memory purposes uh, for just the rules the laws of the game and how to play it um, properly fundamentals uh, will be key for me to do better in this new sport of mine um, so I mean that being said Dude, you guys are really showing so much support. I really appreciate everything um, you guys are commenting about, doing, and once again, don't take it personal or like get on me too hard about my pronunciation or things that I say, offense or defense stuff. Once again, I'm American. Rugby is not much of an American sport yet. Um, and you know, I'm, I, I grew up playing football. So those wordings and understandings are still implemented in my brain. Uh, therefore, it's, it helps me better understand certain situations or just just terminology. So as time goes on, once again, I've only been doing this for two weeks. So, you know, saying, you know, attack instead of, I mean, offense instead of attack or uh, defense instead of defend, you know, they're simple, simple things, simple changes that will come later on in time as I get deeper and deeper into rugby or even somebody complained about me saying practice instead of training it's rugby training not practice like give me a break guys 
you know, I'm, I'm, I'm trying my best here. I've only been doing it for two weeks, you know, so as time goes on, I will pick up the lingo a lot better and it will be something I will stick to. Um, and then I'll be making fun of other people, football players coming in saying, it's not, it's not practice, bro. It's training, you know, or it's not offense. It's attack. Please don't say offense. You're offending me. <laughs> It's just funny reading the comments about stuff like that. Um, but, dude, YouTube videos, you know, I, I've been a YouTuber for a while. And I've you guys that have been here since the beginning have seen me in my highest. And you, for the last two, two, almost three years, have pretty much seen a stagnant, you know, position in my, my YouTube channel. And, and it's pretty much been at, at its lowest um, for the last couple of years. So to actually see growth and consistency with these videos is uh, really motivating. Motivating, you know, it's motivating uh, for me. Um, actually, get a little bit more funds, of course. Uh, and let's be serious, you know, YouTube does bring me funds. So the more views and stuff that I get, and likes and comments, um, the more reach that I get. I'm actually getting subscribers again. I was at a two. I was at 356,000 subscribers for over a year. Literally that number, not above or below. 356,000 subscribers just stayed there for almost like a like a, pretty much a year and a half my subscriber number did not change and um that's pretty it's pretty frustrating for a youtuber to come to that point and still continue to um want to put out content as best as possible um and you know just just do the best i can but um this new journey of mine which you guys have wanted to see is something that um you know has really helped my channel out so uh thank you for that and um you know more videos to come from rugby from you know watching other people's highlights reacting to them to my personal practices and gameplay and stuff and um just talk about it you know um i want to boost this sport that gave me that has given me a chance on a professional level um, and I, I want to help it out to grow as much as possible in America um, because I'm going to keep it really simple with you guys. Rugby players should be getting paid a lot more, period. I don't know what they get much paid and I'm pretty sure that they get paid more outside of America. But since football is a dominant sport in America, rugby players really don't get paid much. Um, much at all and I'll make a video about that and the situation so people are asking how much do you make and all that stuff and uh, I just keep it plain and simple it's not much like I do better off on my own um, it's additional income that is the positive Excuse me, I'm sorry. I have the epic bars. I mean, it's a it, that's the positive of the situation. It's still additional income. It's more than what I was making before. You know, it's, it's a you know I was making this much, and then you know you just add this amount, and it's still you know more. Um, but you know, for me, I could do without it. You know, to be quite quite honest, I could do without it. And um, and there's want that's keeping me because i want to do this i want to be with this sport i want to play professional sports um i want to play on the international level um i want to play against really good teams i want to get better and um that's i mean that's pretty much all i have to say to um everybody but dude um everybody thank you so much i appreciate it look um for everybody if you've made it this far in the video 50 percent off um all of my programs code rugby um i have ultimate athlete programs for those looking to get a little faster stronger um and you know any other program you would like so 50 percent off a uh, code rugby that's a little a little something for everybody who's made it through this far i appreciate you guys for tuning in to my videos um also alpha clothing use code aftermath for 15 percent off um we got a new restock so definitely check that out and also if you would like to catch my live streams i'm live at least four times out of the week even after rugby practice um catch me on twitch.tv slash fb aftermath tv and uh i will talk to you guys later peace out when I was a little boy, I wanted to be a hero. The truth is, when you get older, sometimes things don't always turn out the way you hoped they would. So you gotta do what you gotta do. Handle that business. Believe in yourself. Create your own destiny.